other important observations you made about the chimpanzees? You started with the tools. What were some of the other big ones now that you look back? That, that oh, maternal behavior is one of the really important ones. Good mothers and bad mothers. Okay. Infant development, you know, and how they develop differently. Uh, and then as time went on, realizing that, that the females actually learn by having their own kids. But the sisters learn if they have baby brothers and sisters. And a female who's the last born in her family, doesn't, she doesn't know how to be a good mother because she hasn't been able to practice with baby brother and baby sister. Okay. So all of those were fascinating. The fact they all have such different personalities. The fact that some males really are motivated to get to the top. Um, and even if they get big setbacks and they're attacked as they're making this effort, they still come back when their wounds heal and try again. Others just give up and seem content to remain low ranking. And the different techniques males use to get to the top, some is just brute strength, others use their heads. You noticed some alpha males that had long tenures <laughs> at the top and they, they were more of uh, coalition builders? or Coalition or brains. I mean, Mike didn't have a partner really, but um, no, he didn't. But he had the, he used these empty tin cans and he would charge with up to three of them, four gallon cans, making a hell of a din, charge towards other males who all were ranked higher than him. And of course they rushed out of the way. And then they would gather and groom Mike. So he got to the top in four months and that he had to defeat 11 who ranked higher than him. And as far as we know, there was no serious fight. There were no wounds, no handfuls of hair torn out. And when we took the cans away, because it was dangerous for us too, then he seemed to think, well, this was desperate. So whereas a male would normally drag one branch in one of his dominance displays, Mike would get three. When a male will throw one rock or maybe two, Mike would throw 20 because I, he didn't have his cans anymore. So then he relaxed and realized he'd made it. So the cans was another use of tools. Yes, it was definitely. Continue watching this fascinating conversation for free by clicking on the link below to visit our website, learn from the best minds in the world, and connect with a community of passionate people building the best versions of themselves. Just click on the link below, and I'll see you on the inside.